to a new video about the Sistema Kadashnikova. In this video, I will discuss with you what you can do when someone gives you a hook punch. If thrown correctly, it can be very devastating punch whoop and it can easily knock you out or damage your body it can dislocate your jaw or it can give you any kind of damage you don't do not want to have that and if he gives you a good hook it is a rotational force vector of force and because it is very it's because of the turning point you get angular velocity very high force and it's also because of its structure, it's very hard to break that force. So I do not want to meet it in a cross-sectional way. And you see that a lot in sports. When you wear protection, you can defend yourself against the hook by blocking it. But we do not wear protection. And if I block it, his force would go directly through me because I'm standing in a cross-sectional way and still I would get a lot of potential damage. So just as we showed you in earlier videos, I do not want to meet it in a cross-sectional way, but I want to use it in as sharp as possible angle. And you can see, it does not matter how I make a sharp angle deflection. It can be a stick, but it can also be my arm. In physics, it's not relevant how you do it, as long as you meet the demands based for that principle. Whoop. I'm not standing very high because when I do that and I make a sharp angle deflection, it's still obvious. So I need to lower my own body weight and I can observe how he's standing and force him to the ground using the cross principle. One, two, and just as Alex showed you, I do not want to give him time that he can think of or reconsider any other movements. I want to work directly. Whoop. One or two or three. What I can also do is I can um, see that it's a rotational force. And what I can do is I can make his force, I can meet him in a certain path and I can make him longer. And because he is throwing the punch in a rotation, if he's being dragged forward, his balance would not be able to hold. As you can see, I attract him towards me, so I do not want to stand still where I am because he can do a forward motion and do something else. So I need to work fast. and preemptive regarding the next situation. Whoop. Getting back to my argument about that it's not really relevant how you make the sharp angle deflection, maybe you're standing in a wrong situation like this. What you can still do is you can make a sharp angle with your elbow. So, whoop. Much harder to pull off, but the same principles apply and it would still work. However, you need to observe, you need to understand how it works and then you can make all kinds of sharp angle deflections. Thank you. All right. So, we hope you find this useful information, and if you do, please like and subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you in the next video.